everybody, it's Cindy, and uh, it's been a week or so since I've been on. Anyway, we've been out running around, and oh, it's windy here today, as y'all can tell. My hair is all messed up, and we're wind blown. But today, in the mail, I knew it was coming. The Reese by Noriko came. And it's a uh, hybrid root. I forgot what it said. It said it's Reese creamy toppy and it has a hybrid root and I got this from gallery of wigs I've never bought from them before and uh, it was something that was back ordered I told them to cancel the order they said okay or they never responded and they never charged my account so I thought it was all taken care of well then lo and behold I get a email a couple days ago said we've sent you a package so I'm sure my uh, account has been <laughs> charged too. I couldn't find it last night. I've been off today, had to go, went to a specialist this week, found out that um, he didn't want to do surgery on my double vision. He wanted to try another set of prism, prism lenses. So um, I went and ordered my glasses and I went and got them today and these have um, prisms that are, my glasses I got a few months ago did too that are supposed to hold my eyes into focus and so far I can read with these on I can see wonderfully so hopefully this makes a difference I would have preferred to have surgery and had it fixed but that's not the way it is right now anyway I'm going to try this wreath on for you Um, yesterday or day before, I think it was yesterday, I decided I'd had all, all I could stand of all that long hair that was just stringy and just fell out in glumps every time I washed my hair. So I told my husband, cut about three or four inches off of it. And my hair was really long and I didn't want to totally shave it because I wanted to be able to pull it up completely under a wig cap. So I didn't want to cut it too short. Anyway, I hear him. He's just having a good time with the scissors. He's cutting it for me. Well, I now have an asymmetrical bob that's about this long. <laughs> but that's fine. There's not much hair, and most of it is under my wig all the time anyway. So I am going to try this on for you. This is the Reese by Noriko. It just has a standard cap, nothing special has the um, elastic straps that pull kind of like a bra strap and to be honest with you I don't like these I don't think they hold so when I find out at what point I like them pulled then I just take a little bit of black thread and stitch that elastic down so it holds it in place in whatever adjustment I want it I always take my tags out so here we go it has your tabs and Noriko's tend to run a little bit small and boy this one seems really small and I mean this is, baby is snug oh my goodness hopefully she'll stretch out some as far as cap fits most of my favorite cap as far as the wig cap is the Raquel Welch but I gotta tell you my little cheapy do here my mascara it fits very good and uh, is very very comfortable okay this is creamy toffee which is one of my favorite colors uh, the cups a whole lot like this one uh, I'm gonna brush it a bit And I know on all their pictures, or most of them I've seen on the wig websites and stuff, they have bangs cut into this. I don't know about that. I like my bangs split, especially with the rooted wigs. But we'll just see. It looks like these have some little bitty baby bangs in here. Maybe that's what I was seeing. Maybe that's what I'm seeing on some of those pictures. I don't know. I'll have to work with her. The hair is very pretty. It's oh, so soft. 
Um, not extremely shiny. And the only thing on this is Cara. Of course, this is a little different color, but it's tonal, a little more um, fakey, I think, maybe. Maybe not. I don't know what you're supposed to do with that right there. We'll have to work on that. I haven't seen the back. It's real cute in the back. And honestly, from what I can tell, it looks just about like the Selena. Just a little bit of difference. I think it's fuller on top. It's got a lot more permatease. Which I don't know if it's a good thing or a bad thing. <laughs> but I'm sure as it lays down and probably gets a bath and one thing and another but it's a very cute wig i've seen a lot of very positive things uh like i told them when i was getting my glasses today they were helping me pick out some frames and i said well you don't know what color hair i'm going to have <laughs> now i had a pair just exactly like this but the the frames were kind of a gold color not a bright gold just a gold color in my I mean, I'm having trouble getting my everything straightened up here with my wig and all. But anyway, um, I said, but we never know when I'm going to be Auburn, not red, but, you know, brown with red, brown-headed or some shade of blonde. <laughs> so, I said, remember when you're looking at this, these glasses got to go with all colors of hair. So we decided on these. They're just kind of a brown, anyway, with two little rhinestones on them. I wanted to get some more like the Ray-Ban type, and I'd try those on, and my husband would get the most horrible look on his face. So I decided, okay, well, we better not do this. For all intents and purposes, the, these are pretty much the same cut. However, the hair is nicer on the Noriko. Anyway, that's all. Y'all have a good day. I want to tell you right quick, yesterday we heard on the news that Bagram Airfield had been hit by two rockets that the Taliban was claiming responsibility for and that four American soldiers had been killed and several had been hurt and that is where my son-in-law is and it was a long three hours until we got news that he was okay. So pray for the families that lost their soldiers and for those soldiers that are now injured and pray that the evil of these Talibans and Al-Qaeda and all these radical Muslims are put under and put where they belong. They're animals. Thank you. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.